That was an interesting thing to fast travel to. Balls T Roach. Five. Oh, there's a fast travel place to this thing? Okay. The rats, why did he need them? Bloody rodents. Better to have stuffed them with a poison or crushed them into a pulp with a shovel, but no. Did you see what he did with them? Oh, that's all I'm gonna get? Okay, well. That would be more. Kira, what are you doing? Geralt. <laughs> you gave me quite a start. But nay, the mage says bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat dragged in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? And what's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? Oh. Oh my god, there's so many options. Um, uh, let's go find the number five. Any news of your sisters from the lodge? None. We can't know too much oh, about one another. One. These even tried to contact. I've wanted. Did that. Did that. So I guess it's number two. Why do you want the lamp? You just witnessed why. To communicate with lost souls. Didn't know you were interested in that kind of magic. There's nothing wrong with it. Mm -hmm. Why'd the elf promise you the lamp? We traded for it. He needed powerful magic and sensed I was no common wart charmer. I brewed him a potion. To delay nervous tissue degeneration, stave off memory loss or some such. Who'd he want to use it on? He didn't say. Okay. Ominous. Where did Bet the go? old witch who lived here left you a bunch of interesting sundries. She did indeed. I gather you'd like a look. Oh. Very much so. Oh my god, look at all this crap. Oh, I absolutely want this thing, but in time. Black blood, hybrid oil, northern wind. Very interesting. I can't really sell her that much. I'm a bunch of crap, though. A lot of crap. These are all diagrams of crap that I kind of don't really care all that much about. To be fair. Draconic oil, fifth essence, which is very expensive. Let's do this one. What do I have first of? This. Just crank that down to about 10. This as much. Also crank that down. Got a lot of necker blood. Knock that down a bit. All these feathers, I assume. I assume you need only about like five of every item. Ish. I assume. And everything else, all like the, uh, Flory, florist items you don't need as much of. Okay, so what did I buy? Black blood. Witcher's blood injures vampire necrophage when they wound him. Ooh. Interesting. Killer whale. Buckthorn. Oh, that thing again. Oh, that's pretty nice to have. A quest item. Oh, 
Well, now we know the chort is used at some point. Nostrix. Hold on, what was the image of that? Damn it. Uh, wheat flour. Okay. I don't think she has that. Nope. Scratch that. Was like what? Two? It was one. I killed a wear rep. Ass. I should have its mutagen. Huh. <laughs> okay. Have any of these? Good to know. Bombs want to have this. Okay, back to the shop. I need to get 500 quen thingies on my this. So that way I can return all my ability points and redistribute them again. Because I got that bleeding thingy and I spent a lot of points into the bleeding thingy and I'm never going to use the bleeding thingy, so. Or I could just, you know, not. Okay, so. Let's go for the side quests. Mentioned you wanted something from me. I did, and still do. The cursed isle on Lake Windama. You've heard of it, I'm sure. The local peasants mumble incessantly about it, about the wraiths that haunt it. They claim none who go there return. Yeah, it's wraiths. How'd it come to be cursed? That's what I don't know. I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. Source? Gotta know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Vserag, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the village are that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. It was a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. Oh. Three. So the peasants who went to the island for food, this lord had them murdered? The villagers say he had them poisoned. A real gentleman. Hmm. Well, I never met him. But he certainly didn't seem such a cruel man, judging by what a mage from the isle told me. A mage lived on the island? Did you know him? Where is he now? We were friends. Sadly, he died that day as well. Very few survived. Yet even those who escaped the Isle soon suffered agonizing deaths. Strangely, they did not seem to have been poisoned. Why do you want to live the curse? Why are you so intent on this? I'm not. The local peasantry is. The Isle, miss. You've got to lift the charm. You're a good witch, a great witch. There's no end to it. Uh -huh. See, I thought you didn't care for the locals. The great witch you are. I failed to lift the curse, and they could conclude I'm not so great. Not enough to conceal me from the witch hunters and risk getting sent to the gallows themselves. Fair enough. What others think. Your image. That's all you care about. The point is, listen. I didn't flee to these wilds just to stupidly get caught because some bore with grit under his fingernails grows annoyed with me. True. All right, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. Naturally, you'll need to sail to Fike Isle. Fine. What then? Well, the spirits who wander the Isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how. But they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course. Provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. You'll find it quite useful, I'm sure. Fine. Another random item. Why don't you go with me? Can't you just come with me? I tried to go to Fike Isle once. Thought my head would burst, the curse's magic was so strong. Nice of you to send me there. 
I experienced an acute nasal hemorrhage. You stand to endure a wobble of your medallion at most. At Aratusa, they trained me to detect even the subtlest magic pulses. This was like getting smacked across my haunches with a grain flail. Funny. Thought you'd go in for that sort of thing. Take my boat. I left it on the lake shore near the village. Should be fit to use. Provided Rot hasn't eaten it, as it seems to eat everything here. Okay, how's the work? How's the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it, or do I have to do something, um, magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. Um, I suppose I should warn you. It might not be the most pleasant experience. Figured as much. Tell you all about it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenovox. It's a bauble that will let us speak over some distance. You will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. Wow, we're getting all sorts of random items. Never heard of a Xenovox. It works just like a megascope, but is far more portable. Think of it as a magic box that talks. They hard to build? Extremely. That's why they're so rare. I certainly couldn't build anything like it. So no chance these Xenovoxes will catch on with every mage using one? Not the slightest. Cool. Where'd you get, though? So, where'd you get the Xenovox? Found it in the mine along with the lamp. Thought it was part of the lamp at first. Didn't realize what I'd actually found until later. Think it belonged to the elven mage? Clearly. And I didn't even know the elves used them. I guess I'm off, then. I need to know anything else before I go? No, that is all. Oh, go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Phi Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. And... Geralt. Mm. Mm. Thank you. Oh. New quest item. Okay. So I guess I go to the inventory screen. And that's not it. That's not the item either. Um, yeah, top. Okay. Um, where is the magical lamp? I have no earthly idea where it is on my character panel. It's not there. It's not there. I don't think it's here. Well, if it is, I don't see it. I don't see the magic lamp. I'm assuming it's just a part of my thing. I'm assuming. Highly assuming. Got a grave hat trophy. Oh, snap. It increases, uh, increases Quen. Oh, man. Oh, balls to you. Absolutely going to have the grave hack. Can't put it anywhere. Oh, it's already in my inventory screen right here. Alright, I guess we're done then. See you later, lady. Where am I off to? This better not be like a whole shtick. Where it's gonna be like me doing a one quest for an hour and a half. Like, oh, it could be a simple quest, it could take like 15, 30 minutes. And then end up being like a whole hour or something. What? Oh. Ah! That was absolutely the wrong place to go. Oh. Off I go. The 
find a nice Kira looking boat. How do I use this? Game? Game, how do I use this? Enrage you! Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Can really? Okay, hold on. Game, you lying piece of crap. You said I could fast travel. Almost there. Splendid. I shall contact you again soon. Wait. This Xenovox. Can I contact you with it or is it one way? One way only, I'm afraid. You'll have to trust my feminine intuition. Your what? My feminine intuition. Wonderful. Wonderful. Count the lucky way. Save again. Let me say, I'm gonna die on these guys. Okay, we're good. Rot field. Gerald, are you on the aisle yet? Does the Xenobox work? What? Can't hear. Broke already. Oh my god, what happened? Knew it. I knew it was gonna die. I knew it. Go. Okay, do the notice. The These guys Does blow the up when they work? die. Can you hear me? What? Can't hear. Monsters everywhere, aren't there? How you like that silver? Damn.
occasionally I'll use a mad black to find ghosts. things work. Page down. Okay, yeah. Okay, I remember now. Alright, ghost the ghouls. God, look at all that crap over there. Actually, good for loot. Once you figure them out. What now, you piece of filth? Did it. Save! God, these battles are difficult as hell. Loot. 
new There's monsters like literally everywhere. Loot up oh, some loot. Door and spirit. Oh my god, what that look at that leap of jump. Alright. Put this house. No? Oh. Okay, well. Oh, look at that fast travel point. Wonderful. What the hell is that? I got the water hike there. Damn it. I'm using more strong attacks now. And I'm gonna do better for it. Honey something. From. I think that's all the bees. I have to kill me or something. Let's try Kira's lamp. Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. Sloshing around in his own blood and shite. Be nothing noble about him. Too quick a death they gave him. Should have been made to suffer. He's not the end of it. Sons can suffer for him. And the daughter. To the top! Place is full of rats, as many dead as alive. Think they're feeding on. Look, Geralt, stop. You needn't be so detailed. Peasants didn't come here to ask nicely. Did I get everything? Do I go up here? Oh. Area. Oh. Don't start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'll not hear of them again. That simpleton turned your head. But one Graham hardly makes the rest courtly, one and all. My lord, peasants. They're through the door in the tower. Interesting. So the lamp gives um better context to what happens in an area when everyone's dead because we all know this is dark fantasy so everyone's probably dead there could be lots of dead areas a bunch of dead people who do a bunch of stupid things and us being Geralt the main character have to witness and suffer through it all and the lamp gives us an interesting context because the way we could actually like optionally see it if we really want to Dead any good now, will it? 
stranger is still here, the noble died a time ago. Who's that? Show yourself. Anyone there? Who? Who are you? Interesting. Sounds like some sort of monster here. Also, going upwards is the way you're supposed to go there. So I'm going to go down now. There's a whole bit over here that I just plain didn't go down to. That was it. That? that was these two doors. Oh. Rich folk. Doubt I'll ever understand them. Keeping rats in cages like rabbits. Let them out, maybe. Like to die of hunger if we leave him there. I'd sooner burn the vermin. Releasing him's not like to bring no good. Imagine the harm they'd do if they swam back to the village. Swam? Rats? How do you figure they'd do that? You needn't fret for him. Clever little bastards. Clever in you. Hmm. They seem sluggish to you. Got the mange, maybe? Oh, and that stench! And you also get experience points for using it. Okay. Alright, that's all done there. Locked. Wonderful. Oh, looks like I'm going up here anyway. Where to go? No. No, 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 Okay. Parkour. Parkour. I guess they did. They went in there, saw something. In here. Chest. Ooh, devil's puffball. Like that torch. Where are you? Have you got to the laboratory at the top of the tower yet? I'm at the top. Nothing here that looks like a laboratory. Then you've not reached the highest level. Look for a passage. Hmm. Someone dragged something across the floor. Or dragged it from one wall to the other, repeatedly. Indicator? Yeah, it's just an indicator. Oh, what is this one? Damn it. Well, we're set off some sort of fun trap. Oh well. Looks like a laboratory. Pretty well equipped, too. Why did you leave? You claimed to love me. I'm cold. Why has no one come for me? I cannot leave this place. I see no way out. Who are you? Do you seek to hurt me as well? 
no need to fear me. Don't be afraid. I want to lift the curse that grips this island. Your turn to tell me who you are. The other ghosts, they couldn't see me. I'm special. Always was. The rare beauty. The Lord's daughter. These lands, as far as the eye can see, were ours. My family and I were hid in the Mage's Tower to await the war's end, the end of hard times. It was not to be forever. Mage the Tower? Who was the Mage of the Tower? Mage who lived here. Who was he? Alexander? I hardly knew him. He spent most of his time locked away in this tower. He's dead too, you know. They're all dead. Mountains of corpses, yet I stand here alone, all alone. They've all abandoned me. Even he who promised me everlasting love. You will abandon me as well. If I can lift the curse, you yourself will be free to leave. Tell me what happened here. Peasants sailed to the island to ask for food. Is that true? No. They came to rob and kill. They thought us rich, believed we'd stowed ourselves away here to laugh at their misery. Yet we had little food as well. Too little to share with those who came. They slaughtered everyone. I heard my father cry out, but the mage told me not to reveal myself or let anyone in. He gave me a potion. If I was discovered, I was to drink it. He said everything would be all right. What kind of potion was it? Remember its smell, what it looked like? I remember only that I feared to drink it. Didn't trust the mage? In the village, they claimed he meddled in disease. Not curing it, but causing it. They said he lured rats into the tower, infected them with the Catriona. Only rumors, surely, but I was afraid. So horribly afraid. And then I heard him. My beloved Graham. He called to me. I opened the door for him, but others rushed in. They lunged at me and... and... Your beloved failed to save you. Why? There were too many. Leave her be, he shouted. He grabbed at them, tried to stop them. They just laughed. Did they hurt you? They gripped my arms, tore at my dress. I managed to free myself and drink the potion, and then... Nothing. Poisoned? That how you died? No. For I later awoke. I was alone, it was dark. Only there were rats, everywhere, dozens, hundreds, and I couldn't move. Sleeping potion. Effects hadn't worn off yet. You were paralyzed. They were everywhere. All over me like insects. My face, my hands. I felt them rip open my skin, then crawl into my stomach. They tore me apart, and I could not even scream. Jeez Louise. Have I not suffered enough? Uh, I have to kill her. Why can't I leave this place? Okay, go for three. Can you talk to the island's other specters? No, I'm alone here. The others, they flee when they see me. I know not why. You do not fear me, do you? No. Used to dealing with ghosts. Though, gotta admit, there's something about you. You're... different. You weren't the last to die on this island. Found a fresh corpse in the tower. The island's a dangerous place. Folks should not venture here. I too wish to leave. The dead man. Looked like a monster had attacked him, recently. The tower home to anything else? How am I to know? There's lots of wraiths here. I, I, I hear them whispering every night. Ah, great. Wonderful. Not talking about ghosts. A monster who hunts here. You must have noticed something. 
I don't know. I've noticed not. Why do you ask? Why must you press me so? You're to be my saviour, not my tormentor. Interesting. How can I help you? A curse born of hatred binds me to this place. Only love's power can hope to lift it. But who could love a race? And your beloved, he dead too? Grail? No, he lives. I would know if he died. But he fled and abandoned me. Left me here all alone. Maybe you could strip the curse of its power by forgiving him. You might cleanse the isle. Yeah, tell me more about Graham. Your beloved. Who is he? A noble son? No, a poor fisherman. My father objected. Strongly. He did not see us together. I miss him so. Each night I walk to the island shore to gaze upon the village. Does he remember me still? Hmm. Said before you can't leave the tower. Did I? You must have misheard. Oh man, I don't think so. lying to me. I... I don't know anymore. It's all a nightmare oh, to me. Oh no. As I see it, you're the curse's focus. The other ghosts on the island, their auras aren't nearly as strong as yours. My medallion started pulsating as soon as we started talking. I don't know what you mean, but you do seem to know some things. You could be right. My fate is tied to the isle, I feel that. Perhaps because I am heiress of these lands. It could be your blood ties to the land, the base of the curse that is. If so, Forgiving Graham, laying your resentment to rest should lift it. I loved him. I'm prepared to forgive him. But I must know that he regrets what he did. Take my bones to him. He must bury them. This will be our farewell. Will you speak to him? Will you do this for me? Find someone now? God. Ooh, that's interesting. I can say I'm not sure I trust you. Because I don't look as he lied to me. I'm gonna go two for fun. Really sad story, but something's not right. Got a feeling. What is it? You're not telling me everything. You know the island's dangerous, but refuse to tell me about the monster that lives here. There is no monster. I got a feeling you might be lying. Yeah, I'm gonna push this. I think you're lying. Question is, why? To protect the beast? Or is it that... Stop! I will not hear this! I can't help you. Taking anything off this cursed island, from any cursed place, just too dangerous. And a dead woman's bones, that's asking for trouble. They said witches are heartless beasts. Uh-oh. Will you bring Graham here then? I so long to say goodbye. Annabelle, listen. You never wish to help me, and here I have someone would finally take pity on me. Oh boy, here we go. Yep. Alright, time to get that ready. Oh man, she controls the rats too. I shouldn't do that much. Damn it, gotta catch them. What? Are you kidding me? What are you, five? Why do I have to chase you? Oh, I can't deal damage to you? No. I'll just beef up my clan. Get some food. Casually stroll on. I'll just skip to the bottom. Yeah? Okay, I guess we're doing this then. Burn, baby, burn. Where'd you go? This way? Lady, where are you going? Oh, okay, you're not gonna fight me on the, in the uh, cramped indoor, indoors? Be better for you. Do I have to use it? I don't want to use it. Oh my god, she's gonna get wrecked. Oh my god. You know me. What was that? The 
sounded for a moment like you joined the race yourself. Had to fight a pester. A pester? And did you learn how to lift the curse before you lunged at her, sword in hand? How dare you! Yeah, we talked a bit. Looks like I need to get her beloved to the island. Fisherman named Graham. I know the man. He lives in Oriton, village on the lakeshore. Find him immediately. We're close to unraveling this. I can feel it. All right, I guess I'm going off to find a random dude to tell him to come into the bloody island. You've been following me. Um, what do you want from Graham? Just wondering what you want from him, from Graham. Me? Didn't want nothing. It's his mother be worried about him. Been locked in his hut since he came back from the Isle. Thanks to no soul. Love's misery curdled his brains, I reckon. Makes sense. Let's go in there. <laughs> I want to talk. You deaf, damn it! I told you. Who are you? I'm a witcher. I'm a witcher. What of it? Why should I care? I've been to the island. I know what happened there. What do you want of me? I want to talk to you about Annabelle. Annabelle? What can you know about her? I met her. Talked to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't save her. Two. Did you love her? I... Something mad. Loved her so deep I believed we'd come through, believed we'd be together. Of course, it was not to her father's liking. His daughter in a plain lout. Alright. What happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. Twere Millie, Finch, and Faulkner. They rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the Isle, take back what was ours from the noble. They knew I was known at the tower, that the Lord's servants would open the gate for me as soon as I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I. I saw my chance in it. For Annabelle and me to flee. But it all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape. First, then she drank the poison. Mage must have gave it her. I ran out the tower hollering that I wanted to die, cursing them all to hell. Don't force me to speak of it. No more, please. What exactly did you say? Said you were hollering as you fled the tower, the island. What exactly did you say? I... don't remember. I wanted them to pay for what they'd done to her. Might have cursed them. There's a powerful magic aura on Fike Isle. Passions, evil intent, strong emotions of any kind can activate it. Your words could be the curse's source. She took the poison because of them. Well, actually... It wasn't poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. But that means... Is she... You said you spoke to her? Spoke to her ghost. By the time she awoke, Tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. You mean... She was alive the whole time? But... It can't be. She was cold all through like a corpse. I shook her, begged her, open your eyes. I never thought... 
Yeah, not really your fault, dude. It's not your fault. No guilt in not knowing, and you couldn't know it wasn't poison she drank. Gods, what have I done? If I had stayed behind to bury her, I didn't notice she was alive. It might have ended different, ended well. If you'd stayed on the island, I doubt you'd have survived. I'd take death over leaving her to the rats like that. <sighs> but there's naught I can do about it now. Wrong on that count. Annabelle needs you. You can help her. She's still there? In the tower? Can I see her? Yeah. One thing you should know, though. In death, Annabelle turned into a pester. A pester? What's that? More than a restless ghost. A plague maiden. A powerful wraith filled with grief and hatred that drive her. Give her the power to sow disease and death. She suffers. How am I to help her? Gods know I'm willing. Annabelle thinks you abandoned her. Gods! She hates me. And all this time she's thought I ran, abandoned her. Yes, go to the tower, talk to her. Maybe you can convince her that's not how it was. I thought she died. I'd never have left her there otherwise. A curse has imprisoned Annabelle and the other spirits on the island. Love can shatter its power, free her and them. Just as in the legends. If you know the legends, you know one kiss is enough to break an evil spell. On one condition. And it's a kiss from someone whose love is true. I told you. I said I love her with all my heart. Take me to her, please. It's dangerous. There are risks involved. Understand that, don't you? Of course. I'm no coward. I'll not run this time. Let's go now. Nothing. Let's go. I'm ready. Let's go to the tower. Alright, let's do this. I'm going to absolutely save because he has to screw it up. Oh, well. Did I screw it up? We wandered this place because of you! I've waited long enough for revenge. kill me. Don't be afraid, you'll be fine. Let's go, Grom. Last I came through here, I still hoped Annabelle and me would. Yeah, it's yeah, impossible. yeah. Impossible. We could have been together, and now she's dead. And it's my fault. If only I'd been able to protect her. Come on, race. Where you at? I know it's only two of you in there. Can't change the past, but you can still help Annabelle to move on, to rest in peace. Terrifying here. It's too quiet. Damn it. You have not forgotten. You've returned for me. Is... is that...? Don't you recognize me? It's me, Annabelle. The one you abandoned, remember? Annabelle, I... I was sure you was dead. If I'd known otherwise, I'd never have left you. I'd do anything for you, I would you. You know that well, believe me, I beg you. Prove it. Kiss me. Graham, careful. Um... If memory serves me watching another YouTube do this, I'm pretty sure he's gonna die. I mean, this doesn't look quite well anyway, but... Come 
on. That isn't so bad. Could at least get the key though. What's all this crap about? Experimenting on humans. Never would have gotten away with it if the Conclave were still in charge. Alright. Potion vial. What a crap. Alexander's Mage Law. I've also realized I've been playing this game a bit too long. I think it's been like two and a half hours or something ridiculous. Which that's gonna be fun to edit, I guess. Interesting. Kept in there until the end. What a shitty way to die. Where is the key? I know there's a key somewhere around here. There has to be. Because there's that locked door on the bottom. There has to be. Oh, if not, I'm gonna have to look for it in the in the, on the internet and just come back here later. I mean, it's not like I don't have the fast travel point from here. Okay, fast save. I'm just gonna jump to my probably inevitable death. Actually, no way. I'm done, aren't I? I'm just gonna go back to Kira. God damn it! There's no like. Oh, there's no fast travel point. God damn it! Funsies, I'm just gonna manually save this. Yeah. Hello there, Kira. Geralt, just when I was starting to miss you. Who are you? Yeah. Fike Isles free of its curse. Able to persuade Graham to go to the tower with you? Did you mention there was a pastor involved? He knew the risks, but he'd also heard lots of stories about true love, whose kiss can break any spell. Can't help thinking that gave him courage. And? It ended well? Depends how you look at it. Curse is lifted, Annabelle's spirit is left in peace. But Graham's dead. Oh, poor boy. Still, he's proved that true love may be more common than some suppose. I like someone doing some strange research. One thing's bothering me. What? Annabelle said Alexander was studying diseases. She mentioned Catriona. You knew this? All the mages knew about it. Alexander was a highly regarded epidemiologist. I would have given anything for an opportunity to study his notes, but he guarded them jealously. Well, I have two of them, not three of, not of the three. The lamp. What do you want to do with it? As I said, you may keep it. I don't believe I shall need it anymore, given the Isle's been cleansed. I actually regret not going there with you. Perhaps we can make up for that lost time now. Oh? Okay. All right. Time I was on my way. Perhaps... Perhaps you'd stay just a bit longer? There's one small favor you might yet do for me. What is it? 
I put in an order for a few substances oh. from Novograd. The trader was due to be here yesterday, but has yet to arrive. Could you see what happened? The package is rather important to me. <sighs> Fine. Why not? If he was coming here from Novograd, he must have passed through Black Bell. I'll check the area. Thank you. I shall be ever so grateful. God damn it, Kira. You're telling me to do like a bunch of crap. It's really annoying. Ah! Is this a whole other quest? If it's a whole other quest, I'm just gonna stop right now. Yeah, I'm not doing that. I'm gonna call it because not because I don't want to do it. It's just, it's another stupid quest. That'd be like a <sighs> yeah. I'm not gonna do that. That's literally ridiculous. Oh. Wait, what? Okay, well. A battle axe. Oh, it's an axe instead of it being a sword. And there's more damage. Eh, why not? Let's try it out. Be fun thing to try out next episode. Anything else? What about a beast scary? Yeah. Oh, wait. There's weapons. Oh, uh, so they are going to get odd. Okay, that would have been useful. Plague Maidens. Yeah. Pretty simple. Pretty typical. Bloody Neckers, which are good against anything. Rot Fiends, which are just annoying as hell, because they just blow up when they get near low on health. Okay. See you guys. See you. See you bye.